I am getting back into the swing of things, my friends. Hey, happy Monday. I just flew back home to Palm Springs last night from Ohio and oh, it was snowing. <laughs> so I'm pretty happy to be back home. It's always good to come home, isn't it? And get back into what I do and what I love and being here and sharing things with you, my friends. How are you? How are you doing? Um, I love to know when you're here. You can comment. Uh, sometimes I see the comments right away. Sometimes I see them after the fact. But I am here. I am Paulette Reese Denis. I am your, your transformational lifestyle and business coach for creatives. What does that mean? It means I help you step into your creative zone of genius. I help you step into your desires, the abundance that you deserve and desire, and how to do that. So I mix the spiritual, I mix the woo with the practical, body, mind, and spirit. I bring it all together because we need it all. We are all of that. We are part of this beautiful universe. Right, my friends, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> All right, I got lots of things going on. I'm pretty excited about finishing up this year, starting the new year with some new juicy things. I'll tell you more about them later. I'll tell you, I will have a new mastermind program starting in January. Pretty excited about that. And I have my weekly journaling class that is just, ugh, just ripping at my heartstrings. It's so good. And I hope that you can join us. It's a it's a monthly monthly membership that meets weekly, Tuesdays at three o'clock. That's three o'clock California time, and we do an hour of journaling and sharing, and mm, it's so good. I'll put more of that information down below, just to telling you a few things that's going on. But today, like I said, I'm really excited about finishing up this year. So today, I want to talk about power moves. So I love to bring you these, these bits and pieces, these coaching ideas and inspiration. Sometimes I bring you poetry. Sometimes I read cards for you. Love to hear your comments and your questions. And, uh, you know, we're all in this together, which is really awesome. So thank you for sharing this time with me. So power moves. Now, what do I mean by that? So how many of you get stuck in busy work or procrastination? Taking up time, doing things that may not be moving the needle forward for you. And, and I, what do I mean by moving the needle forward? Stepping you further into your desires more into starting your business, creating your business, dreaming your business, or even making the business more profound, more abundant, more successful. And sometimes it could be developing the lifestyle you desire. You're not happy where you're at. You want to change some things. We all want to continue to grow and expand. It never stops. And remember, my friends, it's all about the journey. It's all about the journey. I'm making that journey fulfilling and full of success and joy and expansion and curiosity. That's always such a great word, curiosity. And more abundance and on every level. And it could be monetary. It could be uh, heartfelt abundance. It could be... Uh, materialistic abundance, it could be spiritual abundance, relationship abundance, pleasure abundance. <laughs> it could be a lot of things, but I love to help you with all of that. So what we want to do is move forward. And sometimes that means we need to step outside of our comfort zone. Sometimes it means that we need to take action just a little bit further. So now remember what I always say, thoughts become words become things. And that's why I'm so uh, crazy about journaling. 
and getting you to journal, getting you to, to think about and write down some of the things that are running around in your brain or things you may not even thought about before <laughs> and playing with creation, playing with your creation. Because when you start expanding, your world starts expanding. When you start opening up your vision to more, to a different reality, things change. You change. You're, you start to build your momentum. And we all want to do that because we want to live in creation and living with everyday magic and inspiration and awesomeness and joy and abundance like I was just talking about. Um, and so, uh, hey, my friends, who's here? I see some people are coming in. So if you have a moment, click in the comment box and tell me where you're from and who's here. But really, I'm just going to talk a little bit. So, so the idea of power moves are moves that make a difference. Like I said, sometimes it's stepping outside of your comfort zone. Breaking down the walls of your box. But it doesn't have to be like this over... Um, I mean, it can be huge. But what I want you to think about, what is one thing you can do today to make a difference? And so with that being said, that means what is it you want to make a difference with? What do you want to change? What's important for you to grow in your life, in your lifestyle, in your business? What's important just this week? This is Monday, so think about this. What is important this week? What are the, what's something that you have been putting off or maybe you just dreamt up that will make a difference? Perhaps it's writing some emails to some clients. Perhaps it's getting up every day and going for a run so that you feel better in your body. Perhaps it's finishing creating a design or finishing up a painting or cutting out sugar. I mean, it could be any number of things, but what's one thing? that you could focus on this week that will make a difference in your life. And I want you to make a power move every day this week toward that thing. So a power move is um, efficient. It's using your time wisely. And it could be one little thing every day, but you do it instead of procrastinate or instead of putting it on the back burner or instead of washing the dishes, make that email or make that phone call, reach out or schedule. going to create energy for you that's going to make a change, a shift, a difference. Because, I mean, we can all fill ourselves up with crazy little things, especially those of us who actually work at home. How easy is it for me to go into the kitchen and start cooking? Or how easy is it for me to start vacuuming or doing some laundry? When really what I need to do is sit down at my desk and email this person or talk to a client. You know, or mail out some things, whatever it is. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> so good. So good. So I really do. I want you to think, what's one thing this week that's going to help you make a difference? Again, whether it's in your personal life or your business life or your spiritual life, what's one thing that's going to make a difference? And then what's one thing you can do today toward that goal? It may not take you all the way to that goal or that idea. And then what's one thing you can do tomorrow? So call it a power move. Call it bringing in your and creating something for yourself. Make it powerful. Make it meaningful. Make it beautiful. Make it luscious. 
delicious. Make it fun. Right? You, you know what I'm saying? I just love that idea. And, you know, again, it's, it's easy to get distracted. It's easy to procrastinate sometimes. It's easy to sit on the couch. But I challenge you to make a difference. And you know what happens once you start? The momentum keeps growing. That's what I'm always talking about. Movement creates momentum, creates magic. I want you to bust a move. <laughs> I want you to bust and move. And I want to know about it. I want to know what you're doing. Right? So if you haven't already, you can join me over in our Dance with Desire group. I'll put the link below. Um, it is for women. And you can share what moves you're making. And let's support each other. Let's gather together in our virtual circle and support each other, inspire each other. So join that group if you haven't already and share away, my friends. <laughs> because you need to say some things out loud. You need to feel seen and heard. I mean, you could do these things on your own in quiet and that could be just fantastic. But sometimes to share it and go, hey, look what I did. I did this thing. And that's a second part of this whole thing is, is acknowledging what you've done, sharing what you've done, rewarding yourself and celebrating what you've done. I don't care how small it is or how big it is. I just want you to do it. I want you to grow and live to your fullest and go after those dreams and desires. And that's what I do as your coach. Those of you who've been with me long enough know that. I get you to practice self-care. I get you to practice a daily ritual of self-love and self-care. I get you to journal so you get clarity on your desires and we dream and we envision the future. But my friends, my wayward freak flying flag friends, <laughs> there's a place for being a rebel and there's a place for taking action. But we want to make it yours. This is your time, this is your dream and your vision. It's not mine, it's not anybody else's. And there is a place for you in this world. There's a place for your dreams in this world. And this is another thing I'm always telling all my creative, beautiful women that I work with. This is yours. Make it yours and make it shine. And let's make it happen. And I help you to make it happen. And that's what we do in the mastermind as well, which is going to start in January. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe we're at the end of this year already. Coming close, coming close. And we've got a, uh, I believe we're coming up into a full moon as well. But this is just such a good time of year to get that focus and go, okay, what hasn't been done this year? What is it I've wanted to create this year? What can I finish up? What's going to take me to the next level? What's going to expand that? That's what I'm talking about today is to bust a move. So make a power move. And step into your creative zone of genius. Step into your desires. A baby step, a leap, I don't care. Just I want you to do it. Because I know you can. And I know you can get off the couch. And I know you can make a difference. And I know that once you start, you're going to build your momentum. And sometimes you need to journal it out. Sometimes you need to get it out of your head to get some clarity. And put some priorities to it to make your map, your magic action plan, which I'll teach you how to do. And in my book, From Soulless Job to Creative Abundance, you can get on Amazon which is great. Uh, there's lots of good steps in that book for you to take action on, or you can consult with me, which I would love, love, love. Um, 
I love the connection. I love collaborating and I love mentoring you to be the best that you can be. And that's why I do these things because I want you to bust a move. <laughs> Lively conversations with Paulette. That's me every Monday. Uh, and so I'll put some links down below. I'd love to hear from you. I'd love you to join the Dance with Desire group. If you're ready for some masterminding in January, I've got that coming up. If you're ready to do some journaling with me every Tuesday, I'd love you to join us. It's super powerful and really fun. And it's, uh, it's only $27 a month to do that every week with me. So that's super affordable as well. Um, but I love being here for you guys. I also love hearing from you. So please, please, please share with me, share with us. And have a most blessed week, my friends. So glad to connect with you. See you and see you shine. Movement, momentum, and magic. And it's yours, my friends. All right, until we meet again. Mwah. Thanks for being here.